Today here on Blue Shift Ministries, we're going to talk about things to listen before the three days of darkness hits. Things to listen for. Pay very attention to the skies and weather. Whichever part of the country you are in, wherever part of the world you are in, know your atmosphere, know your weather. And if you know something is not quite right, then it's more than likely there is something quite not right. Go by your guts, pay attention to the weather, have a weather app on your phone. If you're old school like me, I pretty much just go outside and feel for father. I feel the weather. And I think that's best. Put it into prayer. Ask for false inspiration. Pay attention to all the birds and the fowls in the air. If you're sown on a farm, that will help you a great deal. Listen to your animals. Pay attention to your animals. If you have chickens and ducks, have the bird and the fowls. They will pick up the three days of darkness before it hits before anyone because they are very sensitive to the air. If you're someone who lives near the ocean, that's absolutely perfect. The ocean will absolutely pick it up. The birds of the air are far more sensitive close to the ocean. Listen to it. Listen to the weather. Listen to the birds, falls the air. If you own a bird, even better. That bird can save your life. They will give you a heads up once the three days of darkness. It's more than likely they will not want to go out. It's more than likely they will just want to stay inside. Another thing to listen for is your pets. I have pets. I have a cat. I have a dog. You have a cat. I have a dog. You don't have a pet. Get one. They can absolutely help you. The fowls of the air, the birds will communicate with them first. With the four-legged. If you have a four-legged, it's more than likely they will not want to go outside. They'll feel very much afraid. Once you see them go inside, it's time for you to duck inside. Another thing to listen for, to feel for, is interpretation. Interpretation is the moisture in the air. Father's inspiring me right now. He's saying if you feel or there's a extra moisture in your mouth, an extra sweat within your mouth, and you feel something like something um, tastes, it's a different palate, taste on your palate. That means the sky's changed, the atmosphere changed, the sky's changed. That could be a sign that things are about to get rolling, that things, the three days of darkness is approaching. If you're someone who's astronomical and you have a telescope, that is perfect. That is sublime. That could really help you because now you're really going to see the demons from the second and first heaven descend. That can help you a great, great deal. If you're someone who's into the um, constellation, someone who has a telescope and you know um, how um, these things work, you are really, really, you, 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 are, you can be a key member of your community. Help your community communicate with them and vice versa. If you're someone in that knows someone that has a telescope and knows how the the stars and the space and the skies work, befriend them. Okay, father's communicating with me right now. He's saying, pay attention to the skies. Pay attention to the night skies. Pay attention to it. Keep track of it. Maybe even keep a journal. Write down everything that's going on within the day. If you feel there's something, Father will inspire you. Father's also saying to pray to him, to get, to get closer to him. Establish a relationship with Father. This is the time. God in heaven is the time now to have a relationship with Father. In order to do that, you must repent. Let us pray. In the name of the blood of Jesus Christ, Son of David, Father, I ask you, to inspire your children, all who are watching this video, to please inspire them, to listen to you, Father, to listen and to be your obedience, Father. We must be the obedience of God. This is the reason the animals are precious, because animals, they are the obedience of Father's glory. They do precisely what Father says. We must do the same. May you inspire your children, Father. May you reach out to them. 
And may your children reach out to you. In the name of the blood of Jesus Christ, Son of David, Amen. Have proper things, stock up, have food, have water, have the proper food, have the proper water, have your Bible, and have your full armor on. Remember who you serve. We serve a God who never dies and always rises from the kingdom of the Most High. We must fast, repent, always be obedient, and bloodline cleanse. Believe in Jesus always. Amen.